Audio Jungle. Welcome back to Ayn Edition, your, your one and only Ayn Edition. I hope you guys missed me. I haven't been doing a lot of videos because I've been studying. But guess what? I paused and I'm going to grade 6. Whoop whoop. It's a son of the police. But we're not going to be focusing on that. This, his name is Carl. He has done so much for me. I just want to say thank you. He like, you guys wonder who's actually the driver in that. His name is Carl. He does all and he helps me a lot with helping me to get my my, uh, my rolling shots in that. I want to say thank you to him. I want to say thank you Carl. But this car is so nice. It's a fox. A red fox is a close friend, family and friend to us and all of that but he normally helps me with a lot of things and I just want to say I'm glad to do this call. I'm so glad to do this call. Been waiting a long time. This call has some nice things like throttles even. Throttles my favorite thing. But subscribe, share with your friends and family and who's ever out there. Like and peace out. Eyes in the sky, gazing far into the night. I raise my hand to the fire, but it's no use. Cause you can't stop it from shining through. It's true, baby, let the light shine through. If you believe it's true, baby, won't you let the light shine through? Into the night, I raise my hand to the fire, but it's no use, cause you can't stop it from shining through, it's true, baby let the light shine through, if you believe it's true, baby won't you let the light
sky, gazing far into the night. I raise my hand. Okay. Yo, welcome back to Ine Edition. I'm sitting with the owner of the fork and I introduce him to the people out there. Hi guys, my name is Carl and I own this 1994 Volkswagen Mark 1 Fox. So what have you done to this car? Um, so I've rebuilt the car completely, uh, redone the suspension uh, and redone the engine. I've converted it from carbur uh, carburetor to fuel injection. Um, so now I've got a 2 litre 8 valve in here on throttles. Um, yeah. And where does those throttles come off? What car does it come off? So the throttles that are on here, um, it's a little bit unique, a little bit different to what people normally do. So these are Toyota 45 mil throttles mm -hmm. instead of the 43s that people normally use. Um, and then I've also done a longer intake. Mm -hmm. So I've got a side draft intake as well as an adapter plate on there um, for longer runners which allows the car to get a little bit more torque than a normal intake. And do you know what, what do you know what do you know what Newton meters this car is making? So at the moment on first performance dyno it's making two hundred and six Newton meters. Yo, that's kinda nice for um, for eight valve actually. Yeah. And what kilowatt is this car making? So the kilowatt it's making, it's making 113 kilowatts on pump fuel, mm -hmm. also on on first performance dyno. So you have done a lot to the car and that. so this is one, so this used to be a standard 8 valve first and you needed some mods to it and that. Yes, so this used to be a 1300 carburetor engine mm -hmm. um, and then I think Two years ago, the engine packed up and I decided to go the 2 litre 8 valve route, um, converted it to fuel injection and started doing mods from there. I bought it as a, a 2 litre U-flow setup mm -hmm. and then decided I'm going to go cross-flow head instead. So that cross-flow head comes out of the Golf 4. Um, we did some head work on there, like port and polish, mm -hmm. um, some valves, uh, double valve springs, we yeah. fitted a bigger cam and things like that. Um, we left the block completely stock, um, we just redid the block and then we also ran in uh, stock gearbox and clutch. And what cams are these in? So the cam in here is a 298 motorsport cam. Mm -hmm. um, I started off um with the 288 estas cam um and then the car made 110 kilowatts on jody's dyno mm -hmm. jbs um and i was happy with it um uh, but obviously with racing and things like that you want a little bit more each time and so so what you so what so you the car used to make 110 is it still making 110 or so it's making a little bit more, it's making 113, mm -hmm. but how can I say, basically the, from dyno, uh, from dyno to dyno, your power figures differ slightly. So for me to get a good comparison, I would have to take it back to Jody's dyno mm -hmm. and just do a power run there, just, just to, to actually see, see the difference. If it was, if it's making 110 or 113, like you said now. Yeah. Because it doesn't make sense that your with all the work that was done after that, mm -hmm. after the very first dyno, um, the power gain, um, it should be a lot more. Um, so like I said, we will only know once we do a power run on this dyno if it actually made a big difference or not. Are you are you more into race or into stance type? Um, look, at the moment um. The car is more designed for uh, racing more than stance um, and I've basically built it for driving experience for you to actually go out and enjoy, enjoy the drive of the car, um, enjoy the, the feeling of sitting behind a wheel and just driving because with this car there's obviously there's no power steering, there's no ABS brakes, there's no computers that really assist you with driving. Um, so it's just a raw feeling 
Yeah. Just a nice drive kind of going to Yeah. Inside. Um. In what? But also, I was sorry. I also do like the the stone scene and the co- the, the 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 feeling behind the car mm-hmm. shows where you can actually yeah, show the, off your build if that's what you want to say and actually mm-hmm. appreciate the next person's build. And how long have you had this car for? I've got this car for four years. I think it is going on for five years. And and what wheels are these on? So the wheels that are on here at the moment are the Lenzo S2s, which mm-hmm. are 6.5J, I think, and they're super lightweight. They've also got the 195-50-15s um, Falcons on and, there. And what made you buy a Fox instead of like a Golf 1, Golf Mark 2 even? Um, I opted for the Fox because it had the, the bigger boot, mm-hmm. firstly. Um, you can fit tons of things yeah, in there. Yeah, you can fit a lot of things in there. <laughs> also, the Fox wasn't a... The Fox or the Jetta 1 wasn't a common car, car. at the time. Um, so I thought I can... When I saw this one, I just fell in love with it. Um, it looked decent. It was well looked after. Um, and I thought I could actually take this car slightly to the, the next level, yes. To make it extra fast, look nice. And yes, uh, and also I wanted to make it my own. So, but you know, this car used to be my mother's car and he actually bought it off my mother and now it's actually his own car now and he did a lot of things to it. And where did you get your seats and who made it for you? So the seats are originally Sparkle bucket seats. Mm-hmm. They're non-reclinables. Um, and I just had them recovered to match the the door panels. Um, I went for the the checkered um, pattern in the centers, mm-hmm. kind of to to bring that U- European feel into the car. And then I opted for like a suede um, black material so on there the, as well. Uh, on the sides and on the, the sides, yes. Guys, even now I take this cushion out. I'm sitting on the ground actually, guys. <laughs> um, I wanna I wanna ask, what type of racing do you do? So, at the moment, I'm I'm a little bit all over the show. Um, I'm doing a lot of toge runs, mountain passes, and things. Um, and then doing the odd drag racing um, and straight line racing from time to time. And if I might ask, what is your favorite road on when you go to when you go toge? Um, well, I'm I'm open to to any, any roads. Um, I'm doing a lot of uh, roads drive. I enjoy that. Um, and then Chapman's Peak is also favorite. also I enjoy that one a lot. Yes. <laughs> but you guys must subscribe to my channel. If you don't, you're gonna be missing out on all yeah. my videos. And if you see him out there, well, of course you'll shout him out and say, "Yo, this is one nice girl," and all of that. So subscribe, share with your friends and family, and peace out. Peace out. If you believe it's true, baby, won't you let the light shine through?